Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you how to fix error. 1392, the file or directory is corrupted and unreadable. So let's get started. Let me walk you through the process I used to fix this problem, which has worked for me in the past. The first thing you'll need to do is close the error message by clicking OK. Next, we're going to use the command prompt, a powerful tool that allows you to execute commands directly on your computer. To open the command prompt, simply type CMD into the search bar on your taskbar and press Enter. This will bring up the command prompt window where you'll enter the command that could potentially resolve the issue. The command we're going to use is chkdsk, which stands for check disk. This is a built-in Windows utility designed to scan your disk for errors and fix them if possible. Since my drive letter is E, I'll type the command chkdsk space forward slash fe colon. After typing the command, press enter. The check disk utility will start to run and it will begin scanning your drive for errors. The utility works by checking the integrity of the file system and file metadata on the drive. It will look for problems such as corrupted sectors, lost clusters, and directory errors. If it finds any issues, it will attempt to correct them automatically. The process might take some time, depending on the size of the drive and the number of errors it needs to fix. During this time, you'll see a progress indicator in the command prompt window showing the status of the scan and the repairs being made. The utility will go through different stages, such as verifying files, indexes, and security descriptors. Once the scan is complete, you'll receive a message in the command prompt window indicating whether the check disk utility found and fixed any errors. Ideally, you'll see a message that says something like, Windows has made corrections to the file system. This means that the utility successfully repaired the issues it found. At this point, your computer may refresh automatically and you should notice that your previously inaccessible drive is now available again. You might even see the autoplay feature pop up indicating that the drive is now recognized by the system. This is a good sign that the fix worked, and you should be able to open the drive and access your files without any further issues. If the check disk utility was successful in repairing the drive, you've effectively restored access to your data without losing any of it. However, it's important to remember that this solution might not work in all cases, especially if the drive has severe physical damage or if the file system corruption is too extensive. In such cases, you might need to consider using more advanced data recovery tools or consulting a professional data recovery service. If this video helped you out, make sure to join the Show Me Software free newsletter. It's linked in the description below. In this newsletter, I will tell you about the latest software tools and AI that can make you more productive at work and also improve your personal life in many different ways. You can also reply to these emails with any technical support questions you might have, and I'll do my best to help you out for free. This newsletter is completely free and will always be free. So click the link in the description to sign up.